It's been a joyful experience. I'm healthy and I love it. I can imagine what it would mean to someone who is having some problems. It is refreshing, it's encouraging, and it's very, very engaging. It's a positive thing that the hospital's done. And I give great credit to the committee that selected the work because it's tremendously um, exciting, it's comforting, and it's got a quality to it that can't be medicated. It just makes you feel good. And so I would suggest to all of those who are healthy and want to take a walk, come down and walk through Tampa General. And if you have to be here because of health reasons the next time you're around, keep your eyes open. The treasure's around every corner. One night I had to come in with a friend whose husband was in ER, and as we walked, out, walked down the park, the walkway, there were these children looking up at the mobile. They were stopping and laughing, and here we were in the middle of the night, and it had captured their imagination. I know it made it easier on the parents to see them smiling. It was a stressful time for them. I think I made a point of pointing out to some of the people walking with us the stories behind some of the pieces, and it really is, has a healing quality, even if you're not the one who's sick. Well, I think the consideration that's been given both to the patient and to the patient support system and the opportunity to visit in the garden with this sculpture, um, no matter where you look, is something that will ease your distress and raise your level of appreciation, not only to the doctors that operate here, but to the concept of the hotel and producing such a fabulous exhibition of art, basically by local artists.